episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at the Honest Screen Junkies Honest trailer for The Rock. This is, of course, part of their blockbuster summer, where they look at um, some classic uh, summer blockbuster films. Yes. And, of course, everybody knows The Rock. This was, um, was this Bruckheimer or Bay? Was this Bruckheimer? Think. It was one because back in the in it was between those two, but I think it was Michael Bay. You think it was because be, remember that Michael Bay had a great connection with the military, remember, especially in Hollywood. Yeah, um, I mean, you can look it up itself, uh, but I believe it was uh, it was Bay. Yes, yeah, it was Bay. So basically, what um, The Rock? So basically, a bunch of uh, homegrown terrorists uh, take uh, Alcatraz and. Um, are holding these deadly lethal toxins they were gonna release on the world unless they get what they want. So we send in Sean Connery, who is one of the few who actually managed to escape Alcatraz mm -hmm. successfully. And other prisons, because they said he's like he's escaped so many prisons, so that's yeah. like um, they've gotta keep him locked away with lock and key, you know, yeah. like in dark, darkest part of, of prison. And Nicholas Cage, the player. nerd. Playing, yeah, playing a scientist who, um, part of it, in one scene we see naked playing a guitar. So, um, there's that. Um, yeah, this is remembered for, like, just being Michael Bay in his form, in his element. Just, my, like, not Transformers where he went to a level this, this, this is This is way before Transformers. This is, like, where he was, like, he was... Before he realized he had a heart on for explosions. Oh yeah. This was like definitive Michael Bay for a lot of people. Like this film. Mm -hmm. It was so great, has a lot of memorable moments, lines, scenes, just really fun stuff overall. Like and we even find out at, it is funny why Sean Crane went to jail in the first place. Because you find out at the end and it's like, oh, that makes sense. But yeah, it was a fun film overall. Disclaimer though. I've never fully watched a film. I've watched bits and pieces from every single moment of the film. I've never you seen it. Up a lot of films, bro, especially old ones. I mean, I've watched this like multiple times on my own. To be fair, there's a lot of films out there in the world I haven't seen. But no, I have seen enough of this film to know why everybody adores the hell out of it. Too much. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's take a look at what Screen Junkies brought and see what they think. And at their little twist, pretty much, of what they think of The Rock. So here we go for Honest Trailers, The Rock. So here we go. Should we say like Sean Connery? The Rock. The mm -hmm. Rock. Welcome to The Rock. rock. The most like, let's your fight. Sorry. <laughs> here we go. The most like, you know, fight. No, don't disclaimer. IMDb, search The Rock. Dwayne Johnson's the first thing that pops up. Yeah, I know. Okay, go on. <laughs> this summer, we're getting honest about summer blockbusters, past and present. There are so many monsters surprised they haven't done them sooner. Mm -hmm. From Disney and the Criterion Collections, Michael Bay comes the best title drop in a movie in Cage Division. Wild and hard. Welcome to Con Air. I'd like to take his face off. Oh. Wait for it. Welcome to the Rock. Yeah! Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow! Underneath, they were a man who demands you shut up and listen while he's talking. Like hidden stuff that was found actually underneath. Your Majesty's reaction. 
retire, of course. Together, they'll take on the rogue general Frank Hubble, a retired war hero who's getting way too nice for this. I need you to tell your teacher that you need to get back on the boat and go. Right now. You may detain against your will, but then I apologize. No one has to die here. I'm not ready to, to be fair. They turn I'm around. About to kill 80,000 innocent people. Do you think I'm out of my mind? Mission's over. How did this kindly old man well, survive the Vietnam and everyone supported by a boat's worth of badass character actors yeah. Yeah. to look cool and say a couple of lies? Hey, look at it. Do you have a f***ing water pistol? You know goddamn well I can't do that. I want my f***ing money! Hey, Candyman. Candy guys, these are my Avengers right here. These are my Avengers right, right here. For Michael Bay to turn the Bay Area into the Bay Area with the <laughs> Bad boys painting game. About a chemical nerd and an old spy saving the day doesn't even start until after a whole other action movie about them teaming up in a film with so many well-directed action scenes. You'll dare to ask, is this what a good Michael Bay movie looks like? Yeah. That we say, yes. Yes. Come to think of it, all of Bay's best stuff is rock based. Oh. Yeah, pain game is actually pretty good. Can they reattach it? So do a Oh wait. Oh cool. <laughs> no, I fucking love. <laughs> cool. And then what he says is like I'm married to prom queen. Oh, wow. Oh. Walking off his own movie till they agreed to spend millions on a 30 second underwater scene. Basically this moment, but cool. Um, I take, I try to take people on an emotional ride. Thirty million dollars for thirty seconds. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Starry. Okay. We have no choice but to Stanley. Double O Seven. General Grievance. Lady B. Who can take the nerve gas? Turn your face to goo. Hold the city ransom for a million bucks. <laughs> the Candyman gang. Yeah. What a cox. Jonathan Ben West. Boss. And gentlemen. Gentlemen, 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 Hey, no. Legend of Korra in our series Hey Fandom, where the people who make your favorite movies, TV, and games answer your questions. Click the link in the description below. The devil went down to Georgia. Yeah, Charlie Daniels passed away. Yeah. Um. Uh, <laughs> it's true though. Hey, come on, Shunker has one of the best lines. Oh, where is it to go home and fuck the prom queen? But I like his comment back where he's like, "I'm marrying the fucking." Prom queen, you know, <laughs> he's like, I'm marrying the prom queen. Uh, no, but it's like we said though. It's like this was before Transformers, all of that. Where it's like this, this was, was peak, good. This was peak Bay. I did love the line, Michael Bay turning the Bay Area into to the, the Bay, Bay Area. Area. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know. Okay, I didn't know about Schwarzenegger. I didn't know Quentin Tarantino was an uncredited writer on this. Well, how no, did now, now it makes you want to go back and watch to see all the Tarantinoisms. It's like, okay, that's Tarantino. <laughs> yeah, Don Simpson was one of the main guys behind Top Gun. So I remember that much because our father watched like a behind the scenes documentary he did on Top Gun on reels. Yeah. And they did bring up Don Simpson was one of the main guys behind Top Gun, so he died during the production. I didn't know that about the thirty million dollars for a very quick scene with them with the underwater stuff. I didn't know that. I didn't know he walked off. I know, probably have to look up because it's like all of a sudden he's just like, you know what? Uh, I'll be right. You know, it's like I'm. I'm I, I never noticed the wheelchairs. I never noticed all of his good films starred rock. <laughs> so like, and, and the interesting part too is the how they brought up how there was like. So much more underneath Alcatraz, a lot of people didn't know about the hidden. Was it they brought up? Oh uh, yeah. Well, they, it's like years later when people realized there were actually more hidden tunnels. There were there. actually hidden tunnels underneath Alcatraz that a lot of people don't know about. Which it makes you wonder for the actual that one actual prison break of shit. Let's go back and see where they took any of those so, yeah. routes. So yeah, and the best way to put it is how they put it. If you want to see good Michael Bay, watch something like The Rock. If you want to see good Michael Bay. 
nowadays you watch me like painting game, you know? It's this it's just he knows how to do it. Sometimes he does it too much and gets a hard out for his explosions, but like when he when he focuses. There's there's some just, directors where they were great in the beginning and hit the, when they hit that peak, but then the moment they give him too much, that's when they start going dude, Schwarzenegger, yeah. a scientist that already happened in Twins. So I, know. I, I don't. Yeah, it, it, that's what I'm sitting there going. After he like no made junior, like, junior. Sorry. Yeah, after the line he made there with Nick, I'm sitting there going, I can't see, I can't see Arnold doing that line. It's like, especially playing like that scientist nerd. You know, it's like no Cage does that a better job because it's like okay, that means we have a British guy and a Ukrainian guy working together. Yeah. So other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button if you want to talk to us more about stuff like this. Comment down below if you want to share us around, share it around. And I feel like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about screen junkies and their honest trailers involving Michael Bay's. Hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys thought of this honest trailer. Do you think they hit on every point and nerve of the film uh, that you thought of uh, or could think of? If there's any more, you can probably comment down below. Any favorite Michael Bay films? I mean, any that stand out for you personally. Everybody has their favorites. Um, but let us know in the comments down below what you thought of our reaction overall. But most importantly, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And of course, this has been a very Dwayne Johnson filled episode of SRB. Quite literally, Dwayne Johnson. See ya later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out our previous reactions or any one of our other SRB shows, check out one of our playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and Stardust at Super React Bro.